Hi, uh, what's up? Uh, welcome back to, I guess, my page. Well, I'm doing this on my main page today. Um, I'm coming to you live um, on this Tuesday afternoon from my car. Uh, so I'm going to give the market stats for this week for Philadelphia. Okay, so in the past week, we have seen uh, 275 new listings come to the market. We have 77 listings that did come back on the market from being pending or temporarily off the market, but they returned to the market nevertheless. And uh, we had seen 225 price decreases and 57 price increases. So there are properties out there, of course, that are looking that, you know, they're trying to sell their property. They may have seen in a little bit too high or they're getting price or they're pricing their price their property high because the demand is there something to think about and uh for on the contract side we have seen 189 houses that had active that are that have received a contract they're still active but there is a contract on that property uh so there's 189 listings um and uh, from last week, we have we are seeing 387 pendings. So there's a lot of properties coming on under contract, of course, in this low inventory market. And going to the most important is that 278 of those properties, have, well, 278 properties closed um, uh, coming into this week. Uh, and with the current inventory of properties that are out there that are still not necessarily still but are that is active and ready for buyers is 3,301 homes so 3,300 homes are 3,300 I should say um, are still looking for a buyer so you still have an opportunity in this market to catch you a property uh, median sales price, uh, median sales price is still lingering from my past few weeks at 299 so we're under uh, 300000 in Philadelphia. Philadelphia is still very affordable compared to other um, metropolitan areas on the east side comparing from like New York and D.C. Um, price per square foot is worth at $225 per price of square foot. Uh, days on market, are, we are seeing seven homes are seeing on the market seven days. So it's a week. You know, homes are not, it's not new, it's not new news. It's nothing new. Homes are selling. So seven, so days on market on average of seven days. So if you're a buyer, and you're looking for um and you're just having a hard time finding something or you're not or possibly um not really like you can't get in it's just but you may just have to change your strategy as to how you're going to present your offer instead of you are the strongest offer uh so going to market segments this is my last part is i'm going to break down each price point and uh for three bedrooms for an average single family three bedroom house okay so in the 649 price range so if you're buying a property within 649,000 uh with the average square foot at 2300 um for a three bed three bath home the age of the home is 15 years old um we have saw 66 new homes came on the market from last week and the market had absorbed 64. So there's two homes that me buys. Days on market, seven days. 365, 100, like 365,000 um, price of a home, square foot of that uh, house that has a square foot of 1,364, uh, three bed, two bath, um, average age is 98. Uh, typical standard home in Philadelphia uh, and uh, we saw 76 new listings came on the market and the uh, 
and the market absorbed 87. So we have a negative weekly so no the inventory in that in that price point. Seven days, days all market. Next price point, 240,000. Um, pretty affordable, average, standard um, home of great for first time home buyers as well. Um, square foot, 1,109. And for a three bedroom, two bath home with an average age of the house at 98. We saw 73 new homes came on the market last week from this week and the market absorbed 95. So again, we're eating this up. People are eating, the market is eating these homes up. Uh, days on market, seven. And the last price point is 135,000. And if you're lucky to find something at this price point, that is in good condition, or at least that you're probably going to fix up or it's, you know, you're able to, do, you're able to live in it. Those homes are being snatched up. I'm being seeing that like at even lower. Um, those are investor style types of homes. So prices are going up there. So for that square foot, 1,072, three bed, one bath, which is typical, uh, 90, an age of 96 of these homes, um, for the home age of the home, 96. Um, we saw 99 new homes came on this market in this price point with the market absorbing 84. So there's some inventory out there <laughs> if you're able to get it. Again, average days on market seven. So uh, that is my market update. Just a quick thing. Um, stay tuned for next week. And if you're thinking about either buying or selling in this market, the market is really great for sellers. Of course, we need more inventory. Or if you know anybody that's thinking about selling, Please pass my name along. I am, uh, my name is Victoria Mack. I am with Compass uh, from the Casella Group. Um, more specifically, that's my team. <laughs> and, um, and I specialize in Philadelphia. So thank you for uh, tuning in. And please like and share this as well. Thank you. And com leave a comment if you can. Let me know what you think, what, what was the most important, and what else you would like to know. Uh, thank you and have a great day.